Hello my fellow YouTubers and this is Nerdhoods with you and today I want to show you guys how to convert videos on your iPhone, iPod, iPad. And so it's a really easy process and pretty easy actually and a very easy thingy, magic, whatever, yeah, program. So just first go to Google and write video or uh, iPad converter and this is the one this is the one, yes. Make sure it says free iPad video converter. Click it. But it actually works for everything. It works for iPod Touch, it works for iPhone. Yeah. So just click on download now, but I'm not going to do that because I already have one. I already have it, I mean. <clears throat> so after you click on the. Actually, I'll just show you that after you click on download now, it's going to give you two versions. Oopsie. Didn't mean to download it. It's going to give you two versions, so it's going to have the Windows version and the Mac version, and you download whatever laptop you have. So after you do that, a small box is going to appear, and it's going to have the video or iPad converter icon on it, and it's going to have, like, it's going to inform you to drag the icon to the applications folder, and that's what you do, and then voila, it's installed. After you do install it, you're going to click, you're going to search it up, video or iPad converter, it's going to pop up pop up pop up okay now first thing there's gonna be like the settings and they're gonna ask you what device you have and etc and you just do that but I already did that so I'm not gonna show that unfortunately anyways it's, it's really easy so I don't think like I need to show it so after that you just go there's the home tab convert progress settings you click on the convert tab and then there is normal mode and power mode when you customize to customize your settings you need to connect to the internet just the beginning and then the converting process doesn't need to be you like you don't have to use the internet for it to convert but just for the customizing settings do connect it on the internet because it, like, it lets you to like it, le it lets you choose like how many like the quality and the audio I think it's better because you get to decide whether you want it to be a bigger MB thingy or a smaller MB so I'm gonna show you here I'm gonna click normal mode and I'm gonna select my file and I'm gonna select Modern Family. And I'm gonna go next. Just keep the output directory in there. I'm just gonna keep it. I can rename it if I want. So I'll just remove this, for example. And then I do next. And then here is the thing where, it, where you need the internet to customize this. So it's 180 MB. Just change it to HDTV. And it'll still be 180 MB. Video quality is what will make it higher the MB like best it'll go up all up to 662 so I just say stick to basic it doesn't really actually it just stays the same I don't I don't really see much of a difference so I, I really recommend it to let it be basic just make sure to have the enhanced quality on and the audio quality best and then you go next and then voila start converting and that's all you gotta do. You view conversion progress and you got it over there. And once the video is done, you'll have it in the red Kawa folder. Red Kawa, yep, over there. And it will display all your videos. Your videos, it will display them all. All of the videos you got, all of the videos you converted. These are all the videos I converted. And that is it. I think it's a very easy process. And if you guys do have a better converter program, please do leave a comment below. And please, guys, thank you so much for watching. And please, I hope, like, I really hope this helped you guys. And please do leave a comment, think, like, about your ideas and stuff, about what you think about it. And if you guys have any more questions, and please don't forget to subscribe. Please, please do subscribe. And thanks again for watching. Bye bye. Bye-bye from the Nerdhood. Bye-bye from the Nerdville. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.